Hey everyone, Syncross here. So we're back with another um, free-to-play video. I'm on my free-to-play character, Anglicum. And it has been a while since I have logged her on, I'll be honest. Um, the last time I logged her on was to actually just check uh, the expedition fuel. So it looks like we are about to run out of that. And let's go ahead and replenish. Um, actually, we have run out of it because it's been more than a day, right? So let's go ahead and purchase the maximum amount that you can use, which is 20 hours. Come on. What's going on? There you go. And let's go ahead and use some of these things that we have accumulated by going offline. Which is pretty convenient because I want to see where we are. If I can remember where we are in this game, uh, in this in this character. Alright, so switch 3 looks like it is where where it's at and we want to unlock grade 9 gears <coughs> um, and unlock the uh, heal skill as well as the laser guide I didn't know oh I didn't know that that was unlocked before alright so yeah first things first I'm doing this at 2.30 in the morning so I would probably probably be a good idea since I haven't logged on to it for a few a couple of days um, you want to make the most out of an hour of gaming on this and I want to try and um, I don't want I want to do two at least the this you know today and when the server refreshes in oh it actually I might not even make it to the server refresh so it's going to be 3.30 by I end this video I'll just go, okay, that's fine. Um, we're waiting for that. You can just complete these sub-quests. So I got a signet there. Saw a vid I saw a video, a random video, about someone complaining that this game is heavily, is only playable by paying customers, but I don't see you know how that's true because you can definitely go a long way without paying a single you know a single dollar on this game you won't be as competitive but the game still gives you a lot of st a lot of things to do i mean there's not there's only um a handful of stuff that you're lo you're kind of locked out of um, from enjoying to the fullest um but But it's not in you know that, like for example the boss hunt right? Um, the boss, what was that name of the dungeon? Why am I even trying to guess it? It's right here. The the boss club. That's something that you're locked out of. But even if you did have like VIP four, this all becomes pretty useless in time because only VIP four can enter floor one for free anyway um, and by the time that you're you're gonna be so like once you reach the legend levels you won't need these gears anymore and you can't farm them because y y there's a penalty like once you get a high enough a high enough level um, a high enough level you don't get the rewards anymore even if you kill the you know the, the mobs here so then there's floor two which and onwards that will cost like a vip five uh vip five you know vip four and lower so even if you're vip four you you still can do v floor two floor three four four and for floor five and look at floor five like you only have like two two eleven grade eleven mobs and one grade twelve mobs mo one grade twelve mob and you know, spending 200 bound diamonds for that, you must be really, um, what do you call this, desperate for gears if you're, if you're going, you know, if you're going into this dungeon to only do, uh, a single grade 12, for example. Uh, yeah, so nothing pretty, nothing 
useful here. What you do, what does count a little bit is this one. This is like a solo boss hunt, and unlike the this boss club, which is purely trash, if you ask me, boss hunt is uh, something that is for you know for both VIP and VIP non-VIP players. But you need to get the hunting tickets, and the hunting tickets you can get for free every Monday if you're lucky. Um, but these give like have a very high chance of giving you stuff. Um, and to get those tickets, you need to be doing some stuff, you know, some things with. I think there's that praying. When you see that praying quest, um, I, I don't know if it's gonna come up after we exit out of this dungeon but yeah get a chance for those so look at all of this that I all the things that I have amassed um, we're just gonna go free because our bound diamonds are gonna run out on us if we're not careful I mean let's see how much will it cost yeah I mean <clears throat> you might think like it's not a lot but <clears throat> if you do this every day <laughs> you're gonna l run out of uh, resources my friend so let's go ahead and re retrieve everything that's gonna be a useful thing to add this will give me some mount equipment some gears hopefully it gives us some something that will up you nice two stars XP boost more XP, more gold, more XP, more gold. And for today, yeah, why not? Why not register, right? Then for the dailies, go for a daily like. Let's give it a hello a like. Right, and should have gone straight into a daily flower. I don't have any friends. Um, I think you can send someone a gift by going into rankings. I don't know. Yeah, you can. There you go. What else can we do here while we're waiting? XP Vault Arena. Yeah, Arena. We can do Arena. How many minutes do we have? Oh, we have 19 seconds. But if you go into War Zone, click on Claim. Uh, direct defeat one, two, three, four, five. Made it just in time. Uh, there was one, one more that I could, I should claim there. Wow, twelve the levels. Okay, all right, not bad. Um, let's do it. I think I have another, uh, another attempt at that, right? I'll claim. I'll claim all these things. Online reward. Uh huh. The Monday chest. Nice. All right. Let's see. Let's go back into the dungeon. Yeah, I still have one more. Come on. So when I do these XP events, um, and daily XP dungeons, this is the time like I like I try to get other things done so that you're not wasting time. And yeah, there you go, glory shop. You want to buy this one? Absolutely. This you're probably gonna we'll worry about that in the future. Yeah. And then uh, what else do I need? XP dungeon tickets. I already have those. I'll just buy them when I when I need them. Seven day login. Well, this is gonna be fun. One, two, three, four. Yep, we've been absent for a week. <laughs> All right, let's wear these. Get these gems out of the way. Use these experience books. Wow, all right. What else can we do? Oh, do we, do we, oh, that was fast. Oh, we're just going into the XP dungeon, okay. Alrighty, right. Let's see if we can get this completed now. 
Perfect. Activate that god. Great. Confirm that. Our first god. See? Free. Nothing to it. So if you play like seven days straight, game gives you your god. Um, the other gods that you can get for free, like without spending anything, um, would be Artemis. Artemis or Artemis. You're going to get that from your divine divine shop uh, at a certain level it will allow you to buy some shards for Artemis it's not showing for me because maybe my level is too low or I'm sorry that would be the snow queen I'm thinking about this the snow queen so at legend 50 you can buy 30 of those and in two weeks you've got you can you can basically get <laughs> your second god um, the third god Art Artemis or Artemis, you can get him through the uh, what's that name of that mode? F you can get like ten pieces of him through the league shop, um, but that unlocks at a later time. So I don't know if I can show that to you here. No, I cannot. But there's this league invasion. Ah, you can get this too cool very nice so yeah I'm part of no this guild is also a Noah guild so we got these early but I can't open them <laughs> that scapular system is due to unlock at a much much later time dailies no I didn't top up anything um, oh seven day gifts cool let's go ahead and open these It's a shame, like you know, you don't have. Um, what would what would be fun is if you have like a newbie, um, arena only, uh, a, a newbie only arena, and you do things like this, like you don't level up, but basically just log on every day to collect resources. That would make for a very very interesting, uh, interesting cha you know PVP challenge. I'm not gonna open that. Um, I don't have any of those so yeah I've really left Anglicum behind but I wanted to revive her because apparently some of you like watching these and I'd like to leave you high and dry um, happy Halloween like if you're doing this event one very very good way of uh, increasing your your CP is by purchasing well, not purchasing, exchanging for the, not the red one, the orange, orange draconic, I'm pretty sure there was one. It's like this one, but orange. This one costs like 488. There's supposed to be something else, and I'm not sure why it's not showing here. But something, there's also a 50 ticket exchange. That's so weird why it's not coming up here. Or am I just going blind? Um, look for a Dragonish gift pack that that is selling for that is exchanging for fifty, and that's gonna um, upgrade your CP a lot. Yeah, I don't see it here though. All right, we're still doing this, and how many? We got a minute left. Um, why is there a red dot in there? Oh, okay, I get a free one. And I got what? Just a token? Now nah, let's just leave it there for the time being. Alright, let's destroy that. That expired. Uh huh. Devour everything. Let's feed our sheepy. Sheepy's hungry. Wow, we, we really saved a lot of stuff here. Yeah, I don't care. It's grade 4. Perfect. Should be at 30 seconds. 3, 2, 1. How much 
XP that we get. Um, I'm also going to create an XP video. I'm just trying to fit, make this, you know, build the structure. Oh, I only got one level. What? What happened? Is it because I'm already be above the? Um, no, I sh Wow. Well, that wasn't nice. Um, let's just get all the other stuff now. While we're doing that, let's get that out of the way. Ooh, we got our baby system now. And then, sure, why not flaunt it? Flaunting the baby basically just puts it in the channel so that other people can can like it. And if they do, then you you can ha you can you have a chance at winning some stuff in the rankings like these. Right, so it's always a nice idea. Like when you see, when you see someone else like flaunt their baby, then you want to like them as well, just like this. And the chances are, they're gonna see a white, you know, a, a thumbs up icon, right? Like this one, and it's super annoying. So they're just gonna click on it anyway, and then they're gonna like your baby back. Um, oh wow. What are these? What is this? Nice. Oh, wow, red. Why do I have a spend ranking? Ah, it's compensation. All right. It's not a problem. Ooh, more compensation. Okay, let's claim all of that. Get 200 bound diamonds, three cultivate boxes, 12 bead cultivations. Optional, you don't want to open that. Um, nope. So, everything that's optional, we just let's let's mark, let's start the switch three event. Um, while we're messing around with our UI, let's put that away. Okay. Need to kill 30. All right. Um, what was I saying? Yeah, you don't want to use your shards. Just put them, you know, the, the optional boxes. Um, just put them in a bag for a later time. You use your optional, you use your optional shards for uh, optional boxes. What am I doing? To fill in the blanks, like you don't you don't open them up like as soon as you get them. You open them up when you need them. All right, so that's the first one. Um, I can't open these up yet because I haven't unlocked that feature yet. Optional partner. So let's say somewhere down the road, I I got like 27 pieces because I've got three here. 27 shards of whoever this one supports, right? Um, let's see if I click on you. Let's say I had 27 pieces of Cherry Lady uh, for so, for one reason or another. Then I can at least have like three of the, you know, an option to actually fill in the blanks is what I call it. Um, and, and just allocate three. Tell, tell this box to give you three shard la Cherry Ladies. That's the smart way of you doing this. And the same thing with God's. So you never want to open these and, and say, ah, I want Hades. If you're not going to be completing a god or a spirit or or an arms, um, you know, or mounts or costumes, if you get, when you get these optional boxes, unless you're completing them, don't open them. Save it for a rainy day. What else can I put in my, yeah, let's put that in the, in the chest. All right, we're done with stage two. That was fast. What do we want to do now? Talk to the village girl. So switch three isn't really um, as hard. It's switch four that becomes re super annoying because you get you need to complete like a you need to fill up some nodes in order to fit you know in order to progress and unless you do that you can't get any further in the game and 
basically switch three switch four kind of it's like leveling up four or five times I, I forget but it, it takes a while um, so this part collecting the Gaia quartzes that also takes a while Wow am I able to see the league yeah two hours and 24 minutes 48 minutes so this is actually our timer I was on my main and playing and I saw like it's gonna take about an hour and 10 minutes for this to cool down I might as well create a video on Anglicum while waiting for it instead of just not doing anything anything productive so gear hunt I get that free one I also got a conquest string so that's that what that happened um, yeah let's just claim that so that we can trash it or feed it uh, feed it to sheepy all right what else can we do while we're waiting for this to complete I'm at one characters oh my gosh yeah absolutely let's level that up all right let's use these I got a red wing that's pretty awesome curio if you're ever wondering what those you get these from events so uh, yeah, and apparently you also get these from offline grinding. Um, wait, Godhood. All right, it's asking me for. Uh, I've got enough to promote myself. That's cool. And one more. And one more. <laughs> All right. Oh wow. Requirements not met. Oh, okay. Fine. And. This Shattered Godhood, uh, you get them from AFK mobbing. Or you can buy them from the market if you have money. Like, you can get that from the trading house, trading market, other Godhood items. And you can buy them for one diamond a piece. Not really that worth it. If you ask me, because one skill is like 15, requires like 15 of these, and it gets more and more expensive as you go. And let's go back to the partner interface. Godhood. So now it's just asking me for like three. And as that, as I add in more levels, it's going to ask more and more of that. Um, let's go back to wings. Looks like we still got some some stuff there and let's go back to our character page oh yeah okay we got everything in the achievement let's get rid of that dot right now let's go to our partner this upgrade will not be cleared so we're still safe when it says this upgrade is cleared we don't want to you know use something and and make you know risk resetting that progress bar gear all right this is where we got ooh unlock 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 i oh, know i can't i need grade 4 all right so click 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 tap 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 use it's going to fill up more and i think i also got one i didn't click on it too soon Now, who do I want to transmogrify? This one looks better. This doesn't affect your stats, by the way. Just, you know, this is just uh, the skin. All right. We're all good with this. Partner dungeon. First clear. Oh, wow. We've got a lot. All right, 
Let's see what how far along are we? Two. Jesus. Okay. Let's see if we can increase the skill rate. There we go. We also got Taurus. And we wanna be following Taurus because what's sheepy skill? Auto divide no, this one. Spirit restores protagonist HP each time restoring two percent at a cooldown of eight percent. No, we want offensive. This one. So we're gonna follow her, uh, her and advance her. I don't think she'll make it to grade eight though. Nope. Absolutely not. Or grade six rather. That's fine. Absolutely fine. For the baby, yeah, get that. Um, and then let's go to our mount. Wait, what is it? this upgrade will not be cleared? Okay, so we're still safe. You know, may maybe we're getting um, those quest items at a very slow pace because we're not dishing out enough damage. And while we're doing that now, it's got to be helping, right? We got the what looks like a night wolf. Cultivate that mount. And that's it. We're done with the mount. Now, why does this league dot league have a dot? We need to collect our salary. Use that. Use that. Okay. Um. Huh. Athena. I'm sorry. I said Artemis. It's Athena who you can get here for free. But it takes a while. Okay. It's funny how that... Okay, well, yeah. And then we've also unlocked Chaos Ghost Dumb, so we can do that. That's free to play. We got some fusion material. Nice, some mount gear. More stats. Go to switch three. Spirit. I shouldn't have picked this one up because that that means you you can only use that for like your uh, your scapular system. Yeah, that was going to be useful, definitely. And since we have a god, that's going to be super useful, even if it's just blue. Next one is divine gear. And lead battle, okay. Alright, so let's go back and use all of those resources. Mount. Mount gear is super, super rare to come by. Got all these mounts, but no way to, and they don't have the gears. And the spirit, we got some more of those. Maybe we can bring her her up to six. Activate that skill. Yep, just wishing. Um. Yeah, bead hunt, of course. All right, XP beat. <laughs> no. Um, all right, so let's go here. And it looks like we need to fix our tower and get ourselves some diamonds. So 1,174 bound diamonds if we get everything. So a lot. So this is going to depend, like if you're on a new server, then you might not be able to do this. Let's purge 14, get more cultivation beads. we got target rewards too. Perfect, perfect. Use those. Now why is it saying dismantle and I'm not being brought to the dismantle screen? Alright, there it is. Let's dismantle everything. Then we 
we're going to do some nice tweaking. Let's go back to the bead tower. Oh no, it's already in our bag. I, s I think it's in our bag. Yes, use that. Perfect. We can definitely use this one. So let's go back to sp our partner. Not a partner. Um, my spirit. Go back to Taurus. Please unlock. Yes. All right. So we now have that skill. And she's also going to be able to attack alongside. That should speed up our DPS. Uh, increase our DPS. Now, let's go back to the bag and clear those um, gems out. Why not? Also, we can also use these. Activate that. Activate that. Get that out of the way. Uh, yeah, let's sell these. We don't need them. So, Guardian 2 is still active. Sale. Right. And then we need to unpack these. Okay. Nice. So red offering beads are the best. They give you the best XP bead XP back. So far, we are getting 186. And as you notice, you get these offering beads by purging the, the gill, you know, the bead uh, tower. And you get three of those. And then you also get them for certain daily events as well. Don't worry about that that um, warning that the bead, is f the bead bag is full. It's really, f it's you'll know it's really full if you get the warning and you can't do this. There you go. That's the real warning. All right. Hopefully, we get some yellow. Um, a yellow, at least a yellow attack bead. That's one less space. Uh, let's go and dismantle those. Wow, 300,000 bead XP. Awesome. Okay, now let's go back and pray to the RNG gods that we get something nice out of these. No, oh my god, green, and some of them are even offering gems, that sucks, okay, okay, let's go back to the bead, mm. what did we get, well, let's, first of all, let's dismantle the, uh, we got defense HP and we still have evasion, nothing, nothing at all. Uh, how are we doing here? Or is it going any faster? Nope. All right, let's see. Got anything here? Check that in. Check that in. Claim these. Play together. There's a weekly gift for this. You can click click on that and then just get out of it, and it should unlock. Share. There you go. And then even if you don't, there, <laughs> then it unlocks. So uh, more, more spirit. Um, what else are we missing? Well, let's use those. So now that I've got the first skill unlocked, I can go ahead and do this. 
put the rest in sheepy. Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, let's go into the buildings. Treasury. Donate 1,000 of these. Uh, 100 bound diamonds and all our metals. And pump up our... Since we clearly need a lot of attack at the moment, want to dump everything in attack. Then for PvP, I would do the Shadow and Hawkeye. But since I'm not doing, P I'm not interested in PvP at the moment. I just want to focus on attack. And now we want to dump all of these upgrade items on our god. Um, we only have one regalia. Then we also should be able to do some. Do we have any money here? Zero. <laughs> all right. Well, I guess that's that. What's our com combat power? 1,764,583. Here's the praying stuff. This is where you get the op opportunity to get some boss tickets. Um, and that's a, that's going to come up on at 12 o'clock today. Since today is a Monday. Anything new here? Wow, more stuff. More stuff. So see, this is like all free to play content man and it's take it's you know, it will it does take a while to finish mm. I saw something light up oh there it is so this gay arcane one thing that I can you know one mistake that I <coughs> I did was I didn't complete this uh, riotous kill because uh, you know if I was as a um, VIP player uh, I, I, w I really like went through the content and I skipped all of these um, and th but then I ended up having to do these you know, finish off these um, mobs even though I'm already at le legend 140 uh, and just you know ignore the fact that they don't give any rewards anymore but so that I could get this skill which is pretty pretty awful, uh, awesome uh, to have in the high levels you can clutch you can really clutch um, a PvP battle by having the skill I mean all this on top of your other stats easily get like 90% of your your hits a, a critical all right so since we got a lot of those rewards we are free to upgrade more more gear there you go well not more gear but we got to unlock another level all right so now we have all of those um do we have anything to re 150 ah oh only 1500 do we have any bead tickets? Did I put some away? I got two. But that's it's really a waste to do. Um you won't you don't want to be using just just two at a time. I wanna use nine. Like be really patient when you're doing this. So yeah, you get one extra one free turn if you do it in batches of ten or nine. For nine tickets, you get ten, ten draws, and then uh, if you do that, you get this, which gives you more rewards and two additional B tickets. So, if you're even more patient, this this resets on a weekly basis. If you're even more patient, then you could do something like uh, save up nine, twenty nine, no 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 no, twenty eight pieces. And that's going to be enough to actually get you up here, All right? And then if you're even more patient, you can save up 30, um, 30, 
you use, you use 33 then you're get, you're going to get enough to earn the uh, uh earn an, uh, you know some more rewards so it's it's really just a game of patience at this point and since we can't we don't have anything else to rely on uh, to get any golden bead, we, we can go ahead and just upgrade this. Right. Don't worry about messing things up. Like, let's say, for example, if you kind of figure out that you don't want to, you want a, a different build, then just go here, replace it with something random, dismantle it, and you do get the bead back. Just don't dismantle it again. As long as it has it like in the level, just like what it says here, when an upgraded bead is dismantled, the level one bead will be returned. So it has to be upgraded. So if you do it on a level one attack bead, then you lose that bead forever. But anyway, let's put that back. So that's what I like about this game as well. Like it's not too sadistic in a way that it's gonna tell you to, you know, need you to build up all those resources again. You can recycle, and it does give you 100% of that, the resources you used back. And this is true for other other parts of the game too. All right. You know what? You know what? Let's 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 um let's go back here. Replace this with. Let's replace with a deaf bead. And dismantle the XP bead for the time being, because I want to push the I want to push the tower level. This is going way too slow, so let's go ahead and do the bead tower, and see if we can push push for a higher be level. That then we can get more of those of you know those bead packages. These ones. Let's see if we can get lucky, and you also get to unlock some. Um, you can get some, get to unlock some other additional slots. So yeah, you you see we're clearly over leveled and over, um, you know, over leveled for the floor that we're in. <coughs> That's where we. That's what I was missing. And then, if you really want to push, like let's say, for example, you start dying, then uh, what you could do is wait for this evocation to fill up, and when it does fill up, then you can go and challenge the uh, that that level of the B dungeon again. You're you're definitely gonna win it, <coughs> but it only works up to a certain degree, you know, up to a certain threshold. If we don't get a gold, gold bead, I don't know. That was super unlucky. So we now have eight. Nine. I'm going to open them at ten. Ooh, ouch. Fuse three gear. All right, let's open that. Where did it go? Okay. All right. Nope. Still got crap. Still crap. Oh man. Sucks. I hated how that kind of like goes away. Give me gold. All right. It's getting harder. <laughs> um. It's definitely getting harder.
Are you serious? Anyway, we got those. Crit, definitely. Fix damage. Push higher. Push fire. Dismantle. Defense. So we're at floor thirty three now. It's pretty awesome. Yeah, I forgot to enhance stuff. Hmm. Alright, so we're definitely approaching our limit. And since we didn't get like any uh, orange gems or yellow gems, um, that limit is going to be reached really soon. Yep, there it is. And I'm dying. Probably can get away if he does a special. <laughs> and game over. Close. Alright, so that should, that has opened up a lot of other bead slots for us. And that would increase our DPS and help us get the materials we need for for the collection. Yeah, that's that we're, we're definitely getting a lot more. Uh, well, we're killing a lot more, so that should be faster. Um, let's go back to the bead interface and dismantle the stuff that we got after. So now it's high, it ha it will you know select those lower level beads. The only things that it's going to leave or behind would be the things that you don't have equipped on the, in any of the slots and the highest quality version of those so I don't have evasion equipped experience HP or fixed defense equipped as you can see here right smash uh, sure why not and crit and hit fixed damage attack crit no smash there we go so like I said, don't be afraid to uh, assign these and play around with them. So how much do we have? 2,644. Awesome. We now have... Oh, what the heck. Let's get it. We have seven. And that seven is enough for Adultic. <laughs> this is going to run out in a day and 19 hours, so we have like time. So I'm probably going to do a day for video for this one, um, if we run out of time here. Let's just get that out of the way. I thought we did a like. Oh, it's already refreshed. Oh, darn it. Darn it, darn it, darn it. We didn't we didn't um we didn't do the gear dungeon for that yesterday. So Oh well. <clears throat> oh well. I thought we weren't going to make it. Um how long it's Let's check out the timer. 155 19 minutes. We still have 19 minutes. And we can do these Gaia trials as well. Unlock some of the um, 
the shards. Yep, all of these be thing, you know, all of the things that say bounty on them, those will have a reward <coughs> associated with them. And, th and those are activated based on the first person, you know, if this uh, anyone from the server has already killed it. So this goes all the way to the right. Um, why won't it let me go? Ah, okay, so I can only preview one chapter ahead. And then this is the uh, legend, well, legend version, much harder version. Um, but in this one, in this event, you you use your, I think it is the baby that <coughs> that's used, not the main character. Okay. Are we at the right place? We are, right? Alright. I think this is where I'm going to cut the video um, while we're waiting for her. And I'm just going to leave her doing this um, so that we can switch to Switch 3 and proceed further. Also going to be doing some of the daily, the daily quests and guild quests for today. Um, but yeah just the the main idea here is to not spend anything so not resort to anything and you guys will know because if one of these banners disappears <laughs> then i then i did i failed all right cheers everybody have a good one bye bye